Do you have a passion for writing and filmmaking? Then the Progress SA is calling on young writers and filmmakers for its annual competition, Your Freedom, Your Future competition, which seeks to promote liberalism and democracy in South Africa. This competition encourages young South Africans to engage with and contemplate important issues of current affairs. The competition was also created to encourage the youth to think about how freedom affects their futures and have their say. To tell us more about the competition, we're joined via Zoom by the chairperson of Progress SA, Tammy Jackson. Tammy, very good morning to you. Thanks for joining us. Welcome. Good morning, Simpiwe. Thanks for having me and good morning to your viewers as well. <laughs> Let's talk in greater detail about, <clears throat> about this competition, I beg your pardon, and why it was concept conceptualized. So, Turkey's essay started last year at the University of Cape Town by a group of students, including myself. We did this because we believe that the ideal of an open and free society in South Africa is increasingly beginning to seem under threat, uh, whether it's by government or by politicians. So, we decided to start this competition because we wanted to get more young people to start engaging about their futures in South Africa, and start having critical conversations about important issues that actually affect them. We believe that these conversations aren't necessarily being had in mainstream media or within mother body politics. And so our, our objective really is to create that space for young people to engage meaningfully with each other and within uh, civic organizations and spaces. I know that uh, it's targeted at young people, but uh, who is it designed for and uh, what qualities uh, you know, are you looking for in those people? So anyone can really participate in this, right? Uh, we kind of appeal to both high school students and university students, but you don't necessarily have to be a student in order to think about your future in South Africa. So we really are looking for people who are concerned about the state of civil, li civil liberties in South Africa, who are concerned about their futures in South Africa, the type of future they want to see for themselves, whether or not they believe opportunities are under threat, jobs are under threat, the power certain government holds, those who actually question the status quo at this point in time. So although we've appealed to people who perhaps want to be filmmakers, writers or journalists, we really do encourage every single person who is concerned about politics in South Africa to apply for this. I understand that uh, this competition encourages political debate and uh, young people to just air their political views and their feelings and how it affects their daily lives. So what's the ultimate goal? What's the end goal of this competition? So the end goal of this competition, it's really just to get more people to start engaging with one another. I don't know about you, Simpiwe, but I personally, personally believe that there simply isn't enough civic organization or political parties in South Africa who's having sufficient conversation around the issue of youth unemployment in South Africa, joblessness, opportunities. I mean, you look at the year 2020 alone. Yes, we've been affected by the, academic, uh, by the pandemic, but youth unemployment would have decreased even further because of the type of decisions being taken by government. I mean, at this point in time, we have a 59% youth unemployment rate. So the end goal essentially is to get more people talking about it, to get more people to voice their concerns where it actually matters. And when I say where it actually matters, I mean, it's at the top, right? It's with government, it's with politicians. It's to get them to raise their concerns and actually participate more in civil action, which I think is sorely needed in our country at this point in time. So would you encourage the entrants or those who will be joining, uh, joining this competition to sort of uh, air political views which are aligned to certain political parties, uh, manifestos or policies? No, I think anyone is allowed uh, to apply. It's just that, of course, it really depends what your definition of freedom is, whether it's political freedom or economic freedom. I mean, our... Our, uh, one of our core values in progress is that we value the truth in society. And so if yours is backed up by empirical evidence and empirical data, um, you are allowed to apply or whatever uh, your opinion is on this particular matter.
So as chairperson of Progress SA, uh, what's the aim of this organization? What is it that you want to achieve? Well, I, um, like I said, it's really about bringing young people together to discuss certain matters. At the end of the day, we want more people to join so that we are able to actually have a much greater voice in order to further our ideas and ideals of an open and more free society. Okay, so where and how can people submit their essays and uh, their short film and videos? So you can check out our website, which is www.progress.org.za, and you'll see a tab called Competition. If you click onto that, you'll get all the details um, of our competition, the prizes, the terms and conditions, um, the age categories, and what exactly we are looking for. And we really just did the age categories to allow a more level playing field between contestants so that those who applied who are in high school can uh, compete with their peers and those who are still at university can compete with their peers. Let's talk about the prize package or the incentives for those who will be the, the winners. Um, so the first prize is actually 10,000 Rand cash. The second one is 2,000 Rand and the first one is 1,000 Rand. Because we are doing it in partnership with the Friedrich Naumann Foundation for Freedom and Van Schaik Bookstore, there will also be a book vouchers or textbook vouchers up for grabs. Wow, that is very, very attractive. Thank you so much for chatting to us. And when's the deadline? It's the Sunday, the 8th of November. Okay, good stuff. All the best there, Tammy. Great chatting to you. Thank you so much. All right, that was Tammy Jackson talking to us about the Your Freedom, Your Future competition. And uh, the deadline, as you mentioned, is on the 8th of November.